There's something special that the Almighty God will want me to do for you today. But I will tell you a story before I do it. You know, I said someone is going to go home with a, a gift. We are at the Holy Ghost service. And then a woman got a phone call. Your daughter, and the daughter was pregnant, had been taken to Luth. She gave birth to a set of twins. But we are sorry to tell you the twins are dead, and your daughter is dead too. Oh. <laughs> she said, The devil is lying. And concerning any of you, the plan of the enemy. It's a lie. So he said, he told them, keep them for me. Don't let them take them anywhere. I'm on my way. He got to the hospital. And I think whether it was at the Holy Ghost Congress or something before that, I had blessed the handkerchiefs of the people who came and the oil and so on. So they showed him these twins. He dropped some oil in the mouth of the first one, some oil in the mouth of the second, and said to them, don't waste my time, come back. Within seconds, the first one sneezed and came back to life. So she turned to the second one and said, what are you waiting for? Hurry now. And that one came back to life too. Now there was pandemonium in the hospital. And at that time, they were now willing the corpse of the mother to take to the mortuary. And she said, hey, wait a minute. Uh -uh. She took the oil, poured it in the mouth of the mother, took the handkerchief and laid it on her head. I said, what's wrong with you? Who's going to take care of your children? Come back here, my friend. You see, when she was sharing the testimony at Redemption Camp, I told the people present, I said, I'm the father, I'm the one who anointed the handkerchief and the oil. I have not raised three dead in a day. <laughs> but my prayer had always been that my children would be greater than I. <laughs> I want you to stand on your feet and lift up your handkerchief. If you have no handkerchief, just lift up anything that is a piece of cloth. I am going to pray in the spirit for just one minute. And as soon as I finish, well, we will see what we will see. <laughs> my Father and my God, you know this is a very special day. This is a day of joy unspeakable for me. And all I want as my own special gift, Lord, is that every piece of cloth lifted up to you now be saturated with your anointing. these handkerchiefs on the dead. Let the dead rise. Whether the dead is a human being or a project, anything the ladies handkerchief on, let it rise again. Daddy, 
cover the anointing that has gone in with the blood of Jesus. Let the anointing be permanent. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Lay it on your own head. And say, in the mighty name of Jesus. From now on, I will be a testimony. If you believe that, shout hallelujah. 